Hey, one and all, this is Super Zemus, and welcome back to Let's Play Lufia in the Fortress of Doom. Last time, we scaled the North Tower to fight the Dragon Lord, the obese Dragon Lord. Oh, wait, no, that's Dragon Quest. Okay, never mind, viewers. Um, Am- wait, 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 wait a second, okay, Ammon? Uh-oh. Oh, this isn't good. Yep, the Sinistral of Chaos, I believe? <coughs> oh no, Sinistral of Terror. Never mind. I thought, I thought, uh, Ammon was the Sinistral of Chaos and, uh, Deus was the Sinistral of Terra. Terror, huh. It's not possible, Lufia... Back up a little bit. We already saw Gades. If Gades is here, I'm pretty sure Ammon will come eventually. It, it, there's no, there's no denying it. It's, it's more than possible, Lufia. Come on. Uh oh. Well, looks like we have a boss fight, viewers. We have to fight the follower. This guy has almost a thousand HP, but thankfully he's one of the few bosses in the game that does not have a really high magic resistance. So we're gonna be wanting to use a lot of the flash spell. So let's see, I want to have, for right now, let's have Gohan use a power gourd. A girl, we want him to use a power gourd. And Lufia, I wanna have her cast Drain. Nice attack up there. Oh man, almost 50 attack power. I'll take it. And then he likes to cast Frost, but well, he's not that good at it. Not that strong of a of an attack that, or of magic there. So anyway, a cast drain, go on attack, a girl attack, and Lufia. I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna use one of the mind gourds I got. So let's use that on Lufia. Oh my gosh, viewers! The flash ring combined with a mind gourd, especially against this boss, we're gonna be dealing a lot of damage. So girl attack, go on attack, Lufia use. Flash! Let's see how good this does. Oh, please don't put me to sleep. Okay, a Guru's still good. Oh, Lufia's there. Okay, well, we're gonna need to use a, um, Awaken. That didn't go as well as I planned it to. Alright, Lufia, wake up! And he likes to cast, um... He sure does like to cast, uh, the... <coughs> what is it? Drain there. Alright, I'm not too worried about Gohan, because I'm not gonna... This guy has a bit of a defense, so I'm not going to be dealing that much damage physically, so it's best to use magic attacks here. So I'm not going to I'm not going to waste time trying to wake Gohan up. I need to use Flash and you saw that, viewers. Look how much damage that did. Man, love it. Boom. Up, oh, there we go. Gohan's awake. We're good. Up, <coughs> oh, there's Frost. If I have to heal up, viewers, I'm actually going to have uh, Gohan do the healing because, well, Lufia's going to be pretty much the uh, powerhouse in this battle. So uh, I'm going to use Stronger on Aguro, and then I'll use it on Lufia. So, Because Aguro's taking a bit of a beating from that Frost spell. Even though Frost is not that powerful, Aguro does not have very good magic resistance. So, ow! Never mind, I'll use Stronger on Gohan. That hurt, man. Back off! Ow! Okay, well it looks like I'm getting in, he's getting into pissy boss mode. Yeah, you know when he's getting into pissy boss mode? When he starts using the bolt spell, which is the level t or the tier 2 thunder magic, so... Watch out for that, viewers. Hopefully he can cast it on Lufia, that way it doesn't deal that much damage. But maybe I won't get lucky at all. Probably won't. Ow! Okay! Man! Especially when he casts it on a girl. Ow! Oh no, I didn't want it. Uh, well, at least you attacked Gohan, so there's at least there's a little healing going on. And I'm at least glad that this is probably one of the easier boss fights in the game. So, ow! Man, that bolt spell hurts. Why can't you catch? Why can't you cast that on Lufia, the one who can actually take that spell? All right, back to pretty much full. Uh, just keep attacking, guys. There we go. See? Now, that does not deal that much damage when you do uh, do it to Lufia, so... Ah, uh, let's just use a strong... Er, you know what, Gohan? Why don't you just attack? Oh, did we get him? Hey! Alright, we got him. 
Yeah, pretty easy boss fight. Just cast Flash a lot. And make sure to stay healed up with uh, Gohan. Don't don't heal with Luffy. She she's the powerhouse. But all right, we rescued you. Now you gotta give us. We gotta give us money now, since you are the ransom. No, uh, we didn't save you. You're just coming with us now. Or 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 we did save her. Never mind. You good? All right, there we go. No one was hurt except for the follower. But who cares about him? Ah, <laughs> uh, love that little ditty there. Well, bye, Jaren. Well, of, of course we're not gonna stay in Belgium. We had to go find uh, Artia. Bye, bye. Excuse me. Well. Okay, go on. Before you say anything that you might regret, she has a different sprite than any other character in the game. And, and not just that, but she is also half-elf. We need an elf if we want to get to Alfria. Or, you know, just completely jiff at what I say, you know, don't listen to the Super Service. What? Well, he doesn't have anything useful to say. I mean, I don't, but... This time it's important, Gohan! Uh... Wait, you're just gonna accept this? You're not gonna battle me on this? No, no, Jared, come on, please! Oh, I guess, I guess we're all just, all right. All right, what is it, Jared? Oh, hey, a miracle! Probably not gonna use them, but, well, they're there. Would've preferred some stat-boosting potions. Can't promise, but yeah, I'll promise. What? Gohan, that's a contradiction. Yeah, you know we'll meet again someday, uh, someday huh, Jaren? <laughs> Probably never gonna see her again. Ha ha ha! Ah ha ha! Ah, bye, Jaren. Well, you can talk to everyone here, and they're just like, oh man, we'll never do ransoming again. Actually, there's someone I do want to talk to. Uh, where is he? What's up, man? Uh, no, not you. Okay, is it you? Oh, they learned how to stand up for themselves. And they learned that friendship is the best way to fight any evil. And they started singing Kumbaya in the sunset. Happy ending. Where the heck did they learn that? I mean, they should have been just like, oh, hey, Jaren's back. Great. What? Did we teach them that? How, and if we did, how did we, I don't know, viewers, how the heck did we teach them that lesson? I don't, I don't know, just, it just sounds cheesy to me, but now it's time to head to Elf, well, I mean, not to Elfria, but we still gotta go, but now, let's leave Belgium. This time, though, we're not going to the west, we're going to the east. Find some, well, we find desert here, and just beware, viewers, you're gonna start encountering enemies you might meet up with in the cave southwest of Belgium. And even the North Tower. Oh, wait, there's the new enemy. All right, uh, this, there's, right there is the Killer Bee. Uh, you could have met up with these guys in the, um, oh, where is it? The cave southwest of Belgium. But, and these guys, these are the guys I was telling you about how, oh, yeah, they're weak to stuff, but they, you don't need to worry about them too much, even though they can poison you and I guess paralyze you now. Oh, excuse me. Um, I guess... Now that I know that, but anyway, yeah, you don't need to worry about them too much, because they only have about, like, 30 to 35 HP. We could take care of them pretty easy. And a girl's paralyzed, though, so that's kind of a problem. Let's just use Bang. And also, viewers, in the desert, as I was saying, though, um, you can also meet up with enemies in the North Tower, so if you encounter some archers, you want to kind of be careful about them. That, that would kind of suck if you died by them. And I want to keep Luffy as, as close to Max as possible, because she does not have a lot of HP. I think one strong... Yeah, strong should be good enough. All right. Now let's just go to the right, viewers. We'll cross the desert. The desert of the never-ending sands. Or... Sh or shifting sand... Or, or sh shifting sand lands would probably be a better name, but... I like shifting sand lands. That was a good level. I like that level. I mean, think about it, what would be my... What would be my 
favorite level in uh, Super Mario 64. Hmm. I don't know, but I'm getting kind of annoyed, so I'm just gonna use a smoke ball. I've been running into enemies like every single step. I don't even have a foul water! I don't even have a foul water, and I'm, I'm not in the mood to do some editing right now. Can I just... Can I just get to where I'm heading? It's... The town is in sight! Come on, guys! Oh, man, I tell you, viewers, this is probably the hardest LP I've had to do with, um, random encounters, because it's really, it's much harder to edit them out, and also, the, the big problem is, is that you get into a battle, like, every step, and I just, I can't finish my sentences! I'd love to, but I can't! Well, no, okay, you know what? Bye! I have smoke balls, I'm going to use them. I should, probably should... Probably should buy some more. And you know what? Let's just attack these guys. Sorry, viewers. Normally, I'd edit this stuff out. But I'm just... I'm done. I'm done. I want to speak. Just let... Let me have it, game. It's just... The town is in sight. And these aren't even hard enemies. Come on, game. Anyway, yeah. This, back to what I was talking about, though. Shifting Sandlands. But, um... My favorite level in Super Mario 64, I think, would have to be, uh, the very last level, the, uh, what was it, uh, Rainbow Cruise, I think that was it? Oh, let's rest up, but, yeah, I think my favorite level would have to be Rainbow Cruise, or, or the, um, Clockwork level, whatever that, the name of that one, that was a pretty good level, too. I really liked the last levels, those were, those were really fun, but anyway, we made it to the town of Serenigal here. The desert town of Serenical, but let's get some stuff. Get a miracle, high magic. Oh, what else can I get in Serenical? There's one more thing. Should be at the weapon shop. There it is. Get a uh, high potion. And you know what? Uh, before I go buying weapons, let's uh, buy some items, shall we? Well, not a lot, but I really want to buy a bunch of smoke balls now. So I'm gonna buy. Hmm, let's see. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. 70 should be good for the rest of the game. Or maybe not the rest of the game, but uh, for a long time, let me just say that. Hey, that rhymes. Well, that'd be a bad idea if you had fireworks. Your entire town would probably catch on fire. That probably wouldn't be fun. Anyway, we do want to do some weapon uh, weapon equipment shopping, so... Last time was armor shopping, so now weapon shopping, and also, another reason I don't want to do armor shopping is not only the fact I'm doing weapon shopping, but mainly because I want to save armor shopping for the next town we go to, because we're actually going to need to do some armor shopping, so, there, so, anyway, let's see what, let's see what we got. We got, uh, I want to buy two axes, which is really good for Gohan and Aguro there. Ah, Aguro, so close to being over 200. So close! Anyway, let's buy two axes, and then I want to buy a rapier for uh, Lufia there, so... There you go! Oh, and... Almost forgot! I also want to buy... Let's see here... Okay, how much money will it cost? Oh! Not how much money, how many do I want to buy? I want to buy 50 high arrows! Two, three, four, five... That should be 50 high arrows! Because we're going to be using those... Soon enough, viewers, soon enough! And, uh, do I want to sell my access equipment? Uh, yeah, I do, yeah, I do. Or, well, first let me... First let me actually equip it, so... Let's see, Gohan, give him an axe. Axe for, um, a girl there. And the rapier for Lufia. Alright, looking good, looking good. Now we can sell some crap. So, yeah, you want to buy about 70... What is it, 70 smoke balls? Yeah, look how many, look how many smoke balls I have, that's nice. Oop, that... Gosh dang it. I'm just gonna sell my crap off on screen, because it's not gonna take me that long. Let's see, uh... Yep, get rid of the mace. I don't want that. Foul water. I'll keep the healing items. Emerald I don't need. Uh, brone shield I can get rid of. Brone armor. Brone helm. Fly rings. Spears. And I don't really want those poison pins. And we can get rid of those scimitars. Alright, uh, is that good? Yeah, I think that's it. Alright, we're done. Now, let's see, I've pretty much gotten everything in Serenigal. Yeah, we're pretty much done here. Time to head to the, what is it, the Lost Forest? Yeah, we gotta get there so we can, 
so we can head to Elfria. We're almost there, viewers. We're, we are actually really close to getting to Elfria. It's almost there. I can taste it, viewers. Anyway, cross this bridge. We're going to start encountering archers again. So get Flash at the ready. You're going to need it. Man, Lufia is just about to level up. I, I hope I'll be able to make it there. Well, I probably should be able to level up by the time we get uh, to the next area, so not too worried about that, but anyway, going here. Oh, what do we have here? Guide station to the Lost Forest. Lost Woods? No, no, that's another game, but let's see what we got. Get a revive, a sweet water, and, and a swing wing. All right, probably going to sell that uh, a lot of that crap, but uh, you know, it's there. Oh no, whatever will we do? It's, can we get a guide? Oh, well. Yeah, we don't really have a choice, so. Who do we got? Wait, Jaren? Wait, how'd you get here before us? No, that wasn't the question. How'd you get here before us? We just... Oh, wait, no. We went to Serenigal first, so maybe she went the other way. Never mind! Checks out! Wait! Seriously, Gohan! Are you really gonna be that stubborn? We have no other option! She... <coughs> yeah, maybe we will. Well, I don't know. I mean... The Lost Forest way, I, I know it at least. I've played this game a bunch of times. At least ten times. Oh, probably even more than that, but... Yeah, I mean, I know the way. It's pretty much the inverse of, uh, what is it? The Elven Forest in Seiken Dead Setsu 3? It's just the opposite way. Um... She, um, me... I think being half-elf, you probably know half of the way. I don't think you... Well, she does know the whole way, let me... Spoiler alert! But, I mean, if we're thinking of this logically, I mean, she'd probably only be able to know half of it if she's half-elf. Actually, it is possible, but, you know, actually, I don't think it is. You have to get Jaren. I don't know, I've never actually tried uh, going through the Lost Forest without Jaren, but, anyway. Yeah, why not? You really have to come, you can come. It's not as if you're probably one of the most necessary characters in the game. Alright, Jaren's coming with us. Let's go, Jaren. Let's go! Aww. Wait, Lufia, are you still bent on this? We have no other option. <laughs> Don't worry, Lufia. It's the, you're still the love interest in the game. Your, your place has not been taken. <coughs> Lufia, all right, all right. A girl took the words right out of my mouth. There's no other way. Yep, might as well. See, come on, Lufia. <laughs> What's the problem? Someone sounds jealous. Let's go. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> what the? Oh crap! <laughs> what the? <laughs> oh. Lufia! <laughs> oh, well, it looks like Gohan's doing okay. Well, Lufia! Gohan! No! Oh, that was beautiful. Gotta love the bickering viewers. Oh my gosh. It gets better from here, too! <laughs> Ah, oh, that was amazing. But will we be able to count on Jaren to get us through the Lost Woods? I mean, forest? And will we finally be putting use to those stat potions? If 
find out next time on Let's Play Lufia and the Fortress of Doom. This is Super Zemis, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.